I enjoyed my time at Appalachian State University, but there are definitely a few things that would have made it easier to plan for, such as the weather. Do not be fooled by the tour, which you will most likely take on a beautiful summer day. Sure, they'll warn you about the hard winters, but you'll probably picture fresh sheets of clean, Instagrammable powder. But after that first snow day or two, alternating periods of snowfall and sunshine will keep the campus in perpetual gray-brown slush that gets tracked inside, smearing every hallway and soaking into every carpet. Worse than the precipitation is the wind. The buildings of Appalachian's campus are laid out to create a kind of wind tunnel that somehow blows directly into your face no matter which direction you try to turn. Spring is lovely but temperamental. When the temperature reaches 50 degrees, the students declare a mini-summer. The food. Appalachian does not have a traditional meal plan system. Your meal card does not grant you entry twice daily into the cafeteria for nourishment. Everything sold on campus is a la carte. The upside is you have a lot of variety to choose from, although healthy options are limited. The downside is you will run out of money unless you eat off campus virtually every day. Central Dining Hall is the biggest and newest cafeteria, but 90% of the time you'll come here for the Chick-fil-A. The student union has a cafe called Cascades. This is your best bet for healthier choices and quick snacks. Trivet Hall is the only cafeteria on the west side of campus. It's older and the food is often mediocre, but they make a good breakfast. The housing. There are about twice as many students as the dormitories can hold. Lots of students live off campus for the extra square footage and to avoid the crowding factor, but it's hard to dispute the convenience of living on campus. Most of the dorms are typical college accommodations, a single tiny room to share with a complete stranger. The best dorms were in Newland Hall. It's centrally located and each room is part of a two-room suite with an attached bathroom. No sharing a shower with the entire floor. The Apple Cart. You can walk to Walmart from Appalachian's campus, but you will not want to walk back all that way carrying your groceries. That's why Appalachian runs the Apple Cart bus system, a completely free public transportation solution. It doesn't run too late and is often off schedule, but it makes running errands fairly convenient. You can bring your car with you, but most students drive like complete maniacs and parking is a hassle. The Movies. A student-run program shows movies in two different on-campus theaters, all for $1. The Greer Theater shows new releases, usually the week before they are released on DVD. The Greenbrier Theater plays old movies. Sure, they'll play Casablanca or Charlie Chaplin films, but increasingly they're showing 90s films as well. Cult favorites not quite old enough to be classics, like Jurassic Park or Pulp Fiction. So before attending Appalachian State University, be sure to check out our website.